in light of the news that the Arthur Ashe Courage Award was used by Caitlyn Jenner's reps as a bargaining chip for in exchange for an exclusive interview that ABC got with Caitlyn Jenner by way of Diane Sawyer, Caitlyn Jenner and her people should give the Arthur Ashe Courage Award to Devin Still and his daughter, Leia, who is in remission from cancer and has really, really made a tremendously long journey for such a young person. And I say that because of one word, authenticity. The story of Devin Still is authentic. That is, it became the focus of the ESPYs because of the struggle that the nation saw Mr. Still, the Cincinnati Bengals lineman, and his daughter go through, which was highlighted on a Monday Night Football game, I might add, which, you know, is an ABC telecast, I might add, ABC is owned by Disney, which also owns ESPN. Okay, fine. But no one used that. You didn't have Devin Still's agent saying, hey, look, I'm going to give you exclusive rights to feature my client's problem in exchange for an ESPY award. That would have been absolutely ugly, and people have been up in arms about it. You know it, and I know it. So, that should be the same, and it is the same for Caitlyn Jenner, and I'm, because I'm looking at the computer here, and I'm still mortified at what I've read, both on Radar Online and the Daily, out of, excuse me, the uh, UK, Daily Mail out of the UK, I'm completely mortified at what I've read in both publications regarding Caitlyn Jenner's reps basically saying, hey, look, we want the Arthur Ashe Courage Award, give it to Caitlyn Jenner, and then we'll give you the exclusive with Diane Sawyer. That's horrible. That's totally horrible. And here we're led to believe, once again, that this is some sort of authentic thing. There was nothing authentic about it. Other ESPYs are put to a vote of the public. And from that public vote, ostensibly, comes the person that receives the ESPY, right? If that's not the case, then don't have a public vote for anything because it calls into question the entire ESPY's process. It's fake, basically designed to get you eyeballs, and yes, I get it. TV viewership, uh, traditional TV viewership has declined every year, I believe, since 2011, and it's done so dramatically. I can't tell you how many times a, a week I talk to someone who doesn't have cable, who's cut the cord for cost reasons. This is horrible. Caitlyn Jenner should give that award to Mr. Still and his lovely daughter, who survived cancer at such a young age.